the sacred prism. God of all consolation, you choose and sent your Son to heal the world. Graciously listen to our prayer of faith. Send the power of your Holy Spirit, the Consoler, into this precious oil, this soothing ointment, this rich gift, the fruit of the earth. Bless this oil and sanctify it for our use. Make this oil a remedy for all who are anointed with it. Heal them in body, in soul, and in spirit, and deliver them in every affliction. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Lord God, protector of all who believe in you, bless this oil and give wisdom and strength to all who are anointed with it in preparation for their baptism. Bring them to a deeper understanding of the gospel. Help them to accept the challenge of Christian living. Lead them to the joy of a new birth in the family of your church through Christ our Lord.
Let us pray that God, our Almighty Father, will bless this oil so that all who are anointed with it may be inwardly transformed and come to share in eternal salvation. God, our Maker, source of all growth in holiness, accept the joyful thanks and praise we offer in the name of your church. In the beginning, at your command, the earth produced fruit-bearing trees, and from the fruit of the olive tree, you have provided us with oil for holy chrism. Prophet David, say of the life and joy that the oil would bring us in the sacraments of your love. After the avenging flood, the dove returned to Noah with an olive branch, announced your gifts of peace. This was a sign of a greater gift to come. Now the waters of baptism wash away the sins of men, and by anointing with olive oil, you make us radiant with your joy. At your command, Aaron was washed with water, and your servant Moses, his brother, anointed him priest. This too foreshadowed greater things to come. After your son, Jesus Christ our Lord, asked John for baptism in the waters of the Jordan, you sent the Spirit upon him in the form of a dove, and by the witness of your own voice, you declared him to be your only well-beloved son. In this you clearly fulfilled the prophecy of David, that Christ would be anointed with the oil of gladness beyond his fellow men. And so, Father, we ask you to bless this oil you have created. Fill it with the power of your Holy Spirit through Christ your Son. It is from him that prison takes its name. And with prison, you have anointed for yourself priests and kings, prophets and martyrs. Make this prison sign of life and salvation for those who are to be born again in the waters of baptism. Wash away the evil they have inherited from sinful Adam. And when they are anointed with this holy oil, Make them temples of your glory, radiant with the goodness of life that has its source in you. Through the sign of prison, grant them royal, priestly, and prophetic honor, and clothe them with incorruption. Let this indeed be the chrism of salvation for those who will be born again of water and the Holy Spirit. May they come to share eternal life in the glory of your kingdom, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen.